What's going on guys? This is your boy Mr. 75 Caprice here with another video. And can y'all guess where I'm at today? We back at PC, Players Choice, in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. About to go check on Legend that he did some touch-up. About to show y'all. See how it came out. Y'all probably can't even notice, but I know what was the damage. <laughs> Ooh, that doors. I don't know if y'all been here, but you got some plaques here from the magazines. Oh, look, this is my old car. For y'all that don't know, this was one of my. Well, this was my first convertible, 1975. Check it out, guys. Made it front cover of the magazine. Back in what year was this? Can't tell what year it was. Oh, right there, 2015, man. So I've been doing this, guys. Don't think that uh, I'm new to the dunk game. This is uh, my old 1975 Chevy Caprice convertible. Outrageous paint job, Daytona Beach, sprayed by PC. He got plenty of colors. He also started doing raps. Tail Tierra grills. Look at all these colors right here. What they got right here. They got some flip flop stuff. Yep, he got a lot of colors, guys. And if he don't have it, he will mix it for y'all. That's exactly what he did for me. Nice colors. That's a Ford Giada wheel. They're probably going to get colored. What's up, bro? He does gold plating. Finishing up my boy's uh, Chevelle. Got the four Giada wheels with the seven inch lip. Got this brakes with the wild woods in the back. Got the door handles that pop open when you press here. I don't want to mess with it because the car just got painted. Just got wet in so they're about to buff it. Got that blower on top, supercharged motor, getting it ready for this Rick Ross car show, which I think he's going to make it or not. This car got to be done by tomorrow, but we can head over there to Rick Ross. Got six piston wheel wheel brakes. Got his hood over there, some pieces right here, got his trunk over there, got his trunk did before by uh, my boy Nick, the sound factory over there in Texas. Look who's over here as well, my boy Sugarman on it, getting a touch up as well for the Rick Ross car show. Now to show you legend. We are ready. Let's 
Check it out, gang. This is the man that made it happen for me on the color. Pretty much just told him the color I wanted it and he mixed up a couple of them and told him this one was it. So for those that always keep asking me what color code is this, I couldn't tell you man, this is a custom mix. And it was custom mixed by PC right here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. How shiny it is and this car has been painted for four years already and it's been state to state each summer been in Florida four years in a row yeah the wheels are dirty I don't let people touch them because they're billet and a lot of people don't know how to clean billets so they doll them up and scratch them so I'm kind of like I'll just be telling them leave them alone I'll take care of that but look how wet this thing is I mean, literally, it's wet. Look at this. <laughs> well, she's definitely ready. We'll be at uh, Rick Ross Mansion this weekend with Legend. Y'all come check me out in Georgia at the Promised Land. We all gonna be there. Not sure if I'm gonna clean it before we leave or I'm just gonna take it like this because it's gonna get dirty anyways on the road. So I'll probably just hit it, uh, wash it over there and stuff. Probably gonna have to wash CJ's car as well. So. Yeah, shout out to PC, Ernesto, for getting me in on a late notice, getting the car right for this show. And I mean, I think, you know, for four years being painted, for what it needed, it just a touch up. You know, we had the little rock chips flew in the, in the door, which they're not there no more. Look at that, guys. No more chips. So yeah, like I said guys, shout out to PC. Nesta for getting me right. For those that are new to the channel, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, hit the like button, leave a comment, let me know what you guys think. Y'all go ahead and tell Rick Ross we're ready.